And two years after the devastating station fire, a new beginning rises from the ashes. See for yourself next. Two years ago today, the massive station fire killed two firefighters, charred 160,000 acres and destroyed hundreds of buildings. Tonight, KTLA's photographer Greg Taru has put together a video essay highlighting one of the restoration projects undertaken by the nonprofit Student Conservation Association. That station fire really blew through here and killed things off. It looked like a disaster coming through here. Putting our feet on the trail for the first time in Chileo Flats, we were like, we're never going to get through this. Well, the first time I came to this picnic area was two summers ago, and, and it was flat out closed to the public. It had burned over. Done a lot of nice work to get it all cleaned up and get reopened for everybody. So uh, we thought we'd come give it a, give it a try and see, see how it looks. The work that we did back here made a significant impact on allowing uh, locals to come back in and hike. We just recently got into hiking um, in the past few months. We're trying to um, train for Mount Whitney, so we're going to hike up here and get a good look at the L.A. Basin. This forest has given us an opportunity to, to work on, uh, you know, in an area that, that has m literally millions of people visiting it every year. I'm excited to see it and um, get a good look at the, the scenery again. 